NASA has made history again and is celebrating tonight after about five years and somewhere in the neighborhood of two billion miles away. Its solar powered spacecraft has finally made it to Jupiter. Welcome to Jupiter. NASA scientists cheered and gave each other high fives as they declared Mission Juno accomplished. We prepared a contingency communications procedure and guess what? We don't need that anymore. The spinning solar powered spacecraft successfully entered Jupiter's orbit shortly before midnight after completing a 35 minute engine burn. The high stakes maneuver allowed Juno, roughly the size of a basketball court, to slow itself down significantly and hit a target just a few miles wide. A mission of this complexity uh, to accomplish tonight is, is, is just truly amazing. To actually have it to know that we can all go to bed tonight, not worrying about what's going to happen tomorrow, <laughs> it's pretty awesome. And lift off of the Atlas V with Juno on a trek to Jupiter. NASA designed the spacecraft to withstand the intense radiation belts and a ring of debris surrounding the planet. <laughs> As Juno's journey unfolded, it already began capturing images of Jupiter and its moons. Over the next 20 months, scientists hope to learn more about the planet's composition and uncover new clues about how our solar system began. And besides a lot of expensive science instruments, Juno also has three Legos on board. One is a likeness of Galileo. The other two represent Roman god Jupiter and his wife, Juno.